All right, so here is our new truck bed skid. This is the future for us. We will be converting all of our pressure washing trailers to truck bed skids. Right here we'll have eventually an electric hose reel where we'll hold 400 feet of hose and then we're gonna have a second pressure washer heel here. So we'll just be able to take these off and then tap it into the pressure washer directly. Over here we have our handy toolbox that just stows away. Put our tailgate up. Inside we got all, all of our electronics. It's for a 12 volt pump. And then we have these cool little breakers over here. So if like anything happens, basically it's like you're tripping a breaker and you just have to come here and reset it versus having just a fuse blow out. And then here, of course, we got our proportioner. And over here we got our garden hose, one inch. Um, diameter so on the reel so our flow is at optimum level over here we got our soft wash hose 250 feet of flexilla with the handy little clamp so that this isn't going everywhere while we're driving on the road of course we got our flush line to flush our bleach line out when we're done with our soft wash system here's one of my favorite features we have a fill that we just tap in with a cam lock and then the hose just kind of runs underneath. And then it comes up over here into our bleach line. So no more will my guys have to take the caps off. My thought on this whole system was trying to figure out how to avoid them climbing up there as much as possible. We obviously will have to do that to get our ladders off and all that jazz, but that's why you get the 2022 F-250 because they have handy little step. And as we come over here, so here's our water tank, here's our bleach tank, and then here is soon to be a pure water tank that we're gonna, here in the center, we have some extra storage space, so we're gonna store uh, extra things. You know, we have shelf right here, so we'll probably, our gas tank is under here, so we'll probably have a, um, keep that extra pressure washer hose if a hose blows out. Storage for pump up sprayers, soaps, and then right here is where we're gonna put a DI uh, canister that is going to uh, have a two-way valve on the exit so we can either tap directly in or we can be running it off of our little pump that we're gonna have and filling up our tank. And then we'll have the reel right here in the pump. Here's the little pump for a water-fed system. And then this is a nice little feature too. Little roll bars for them to get their ladders on and off. And then up here is where our surface cleaner will go. And then um, the surface cleaner doesn't go all the way back. So we have this little bracket. So we'll have also extra shelf space up there. So there you have it. There's a truck bed skid. Oh yeah, and then here's a, a bucket fill. Um, that comes com straight from our bulkhead over there so people can fill their buckets or people can dump the tank if for whatever reason so anyways here's the future of barrier window cleaning